now we are going to see uh, omicron cp tan delta 1 calibration this is output for high voltage 12 kV AC so the output is 12 kV AC input A and B for 5 amps AC so now we will go to the connection diagram as per the manual the without trolley CPTD1 to CPC100 external booster connection and serial connection for TD1 to CPC100 and in and B connection and high voltage connection these all are mentioned on the manual so step by step I can tell you this one for CPTD1 booster connection the booster in so the connection diagram is here so unblue and CPC 100 this one so same booster connection I can here connector and another one next we are going to see serial interface connection serial interface connection this is a semi serial interface connection mention on serial here CPTD1 and micron CPC 100 same like serial interface connection this is for input A and B uh, red and blue the two boxes here the down the mention in A and in B these two boxes we are measuring on uh, 5 amps AC maximum uh, it will be depend upon the load okay next high voltage connection this is the high voltage kit so this one for one input sorry this is output 12 kV and another one for ground connection okay uh, so input and uh, input and output connection both are clear as per the manual and uh, next we are going to see ground connection so this both instrument connected on ground one is here and another one is here so now I inject the voltage with our master we have a fluke 80k 40 cable I applied on AC voltage measure so another already I connected on positive negative cable so this ground I can take into the CPTD1 ground and another one positive cable I can go to the same high voltage parameter here positive connections I can connect it so as per the manual he mentioned on tan delta option normally your CMC is open quick CMC option is there all the time so when you are opening the CMC always quick CMC option is that you need to go to the tan delta option this button here the tan delta option once you press the option the tan delta option is display and shown okay so is default 500 volt now we are start the test okay I can apply 1 kV 1000 volt this is the awareness for grounding message just leave it just tick and once the input IO option you can apply here showing now it's on KV again I can apply for 5 KV
Stay wait, 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 wait. Rub, rub. Wait. Okay. Now I can apply the five KV voltage. the voltage maximum is 12 kV so I applied only for 5 kV only because of the safety reason thanks for watching this video